His name is John Cena. And we are back, guys, with the John Cena WWE 2K22 Universe Mode. We are the Universal Champion. How, though? Honestly, I do not know. We've had 10 matches. We've only won three of them. We have lost seven. We lost last week in a non-title match to Drew McIntyre. And when we finally managed to crawl to our feet with blood dripping down us, we grabbed on to a universal title and then Happy Corbin of all people came out looking extremely happy but also kind of angry and he kind of looked at our universal title. So that tells me that Happy Corbin it won't be truly happy until he is the champion of SmackDown. Will we see Happy Corbin tonight? Who knows? Let's get into tonight's show. Happy Corbin could be the next challenger for us as we move on and try and have our first successful title defense. Um, did we beat Roman Reigns? I actually cannot remember. We might have defeated Roman Reigns in a title rematch. I'm not too sure. But it, no way, I think we lost to Reigns in a title rematch, but the belt wasn't on the line, if that makes any sense. Does it make sense? Probably not. Probably not. But it looks like our first official title shot, our first official title defense could be. Corbin versus Cena, but maybe not, because in the second match tonight, we're actually teaming up with Corbin. What is this all about? And we're taking on the Mexican lawnmowers. We're taking on Garza and um, the other guy, Carrillo. So, interesting. Maybe Corbin was coming out. Maybe he wasn't wanting to face us. Maybe, just maybe, Happy Corbin was wanting to team up with the 17 team world champion. And that looks like Maybe that he's been trying to get a match. I guess so. But tonight is going to be Cena and Corbin. Very, very interesting then. Happy Corbin and Cena teaming up together. I believe for the first time. If these two have teamed up before, I honestly do not remember. But it's happening tonight. And Corbin is looking very happy. He's even dancing. That's how happy Corbin is. He is dancing his way to the ring, clapping his way to the ring, he seems happy with himself, he seems proud of himself, and uh, who knows, maybe he wants to hold a title with Cena, maybe he wants us to challenge for the Tag Team Championships, I guess if that is the case, we will find out pretty soon, but uh, yeah, no, can we trust Corbin? Absolutely not, this guy's a snake, but tonight, it looks like we're teaming up with him, there's not a lot we can do, we have to team up with him, the match has been made, we have no say in the matches, we just turn up and we just compete. Whether it be with Corbin or against Corbin, that's not really relevant, what I do want to happen though is I do, I do want to pick up a win tonight, I think it's important, I mean we've lost far too many matches, we cannot surely continue to lose matches, here comes Carrillo and Garza. Wasn't really expecting uh, these ring attires, but nonetheless, here they come out. And uh, these two are used to teaming with each other. We are not, so that probably does give them the upper hand, if we're being honest. But I still... F and Happy Corbin just tags himself in. And it looks like Happy Corbin wants to be the man that uh, takes charge in this match, so... Interesting. Happy Corbin then just... Not even letting Cena start the match. Sitting. Oh, and Corbin, he, I think he might be regretting that. I think he's been busted open the hard way. Looks like he's got a bloody no is it a, a busted nose or is it his eye? And Corbin here looks hard here. Corbin is... I don't believe this. Corbin's down. Corbin is in a lot of trouble. Corbin then Irish whips Garza into the ropes. Oh, and he just knocks Cena out. Corbin... Big right hand to Cena, and then Corbin goes flying to the outside. And what's this here? We've got Garza and Carrillo working together. <laughs> Baseball slide. Taking down both Cena and Corbin. <laughs> this tag team is not getting off to a good start here. We are in trouble. We are, we are in a lot of trouble. And uh, Corbin here needs to do something. Big elbow though, so that'll help. <laughs> a big clothesline from the happy man. I mean, Corbin is, a I think we forget just how big Corbin is sometimes. He's a pretty big guy and that's a pretty big clothesline. And now it's Angel Garza launching strikes away.
from Beto Carrillo. Big hand there. Oh, big double boots to the face. Again, Carrillo tosses Corbin over the top, and Corbin almost takes out Cena, almost lands on Cena, but no. What's this? Carrillo just takes out John, hits his finisher on him on the outside, and John Cena's getting absolutely whacked here. Corbin then just tossing Carrillo back into the ring, and this team of Corbin and Cena is knock off their good start here. Big kick there from Carrillo, and I think Corbin needs to make a tag here. He does, he makes the tag, here comes John. John Cena gets tagged in, but it's not much of a hot tag, he's getting beat up here. What the fuck is this? Corbin now and Garza. And Corbin though with a big takedown, that might buy Cena some time. Can Cena get back on his feet here? Cena now is back on top and he tries to go for a crossbody, tries to take out Carrillo. Cena now, working the arm, Carrillo with a big strike. He misses it. I don't know what he went for there, but he didn't connect, Cena. Big cross body. Goes for the cover. And Carrillo manages to kick out there at the count of two. Cena then going for a back. Oh, he went for a back suplex. Carrillo went for a counter, but Cena was there. Cena though. Is Cena going for... He's looking for a slam. And he just... Set out power slam on Carrillo and Cena now might be getting to create some momentum here. Another Irish whip into the corner. Oh, get caught. Big elbow coming in. Carrillo goes downstairs. Carrillo got the army, Cena. Carrillo looking as if he's going to try and climb the top row. Some Lucha Libre stuff there from Carrillo and now it's Corbin that wants the tag. Cena's crawling in the wrong fucking direction though. And Cena makes the tag. Here comes Corbin. Corbin's in. Went for a big strike. Missed it completely. And Corbin gets tossed to the outside. So, Oh, and a big splash from the top. Oh, my God. Angel Garza just flew from the outside of the ring. From the inside the ring to the outside. And he's locked in a submission maneuver here. And uh, happy Corbin there. Oh, what a big elbow that was. Big strike for Corbin. Oh, now he's working on the back, Corbin. Oh, but he's getting to take over here. More strikes. More damage from Corbin to Angel Garza. But Angel Garza spins around and takes Corbin down and hits him with a big double boots to the face there. But Corbin again. Oh, and a big shoulder tackle. Corbin looking for a choke slam. Oh, oh no, a choke slam into a backbreaker for Corbin on Angel Garza. And that could potentially put Garza down. Corbin looks very happy with himself. Hence the name Happy Corbin. Garza is laying out. And can Garza get back into the ring here? Count of nine, he gets in. But he walks straight into the end of days. And he's just been planted. No one kicks out at the end of days, but Carrillo manages to get in and break it up there. So Corbin, just when he thought he had the match won, Carrillo getting in and stopping the count there. And he had to. He had to get in and stop that. But here we go, double tag team from Corbin and Cena. Big back body drop there for the two of them. Cena then looking to maybe put Garza away. Going for a sunset flip into a powerbomb. Hooks the leg. Referee. Covers on oh, Angel Garza, I think was or Humberto Carrillo was trying to go to the top rope, trying to break up with a high risk maneuver, but he didn't do it in time. And Cena picks up the win, and it's a big win for Corbin and Cena. Albeit it didn't look like they were going to get the win, and Corbin he seems angry with Cena here. I don't know why. Does Corbin want the victory? Corbin just told Cena to go fuck himself. Essentially, He's, Corbin's not happy. Corbin's busted open. You can see the blood there dripping down his nostrils, dripping down the bridge of his nose. It's a win regardless. Three star match, but Cena doesn't seem too happy. Cena, um, or should I say Corbin, not impressed that he wasn't the one that got the victory for his team. Even though you could argue he done all the damage, you know, he technically 
um, you know, changed the match. When he came in, he he gave a beat down to Angel Gar. So he hit that big, uh, you know, manoeuvre on the outside, choke slam into the backbreaker. Then he hit the end of days, and it was pretty much Cena that came in and, you know, kind of stole the glory. So maybe I can understand why Happy Corbin is not too happy about how the match, the finish of that match went. But it is what it is, guys. We are still the champion. We picked up a victory. Thank God we actually got another win for Big Match John. It's been a while since we had a win in this series, but we got it there. And hopefully we can stay winning and stay happy. And maybe, just maybe, we'll be changing Cena to Happy Cena in the near future. But that's going to do it, guys, for this WWE 2K22 John Cena Universe mode. Leave a like, leave a comment, leave a subscription if you haven't already. And we will catch you in the next one. But until then... Peace.